Hello my friend, welcome to my new video. Today I want to share with you how I edit my photo for my Instagram using just two apps. It's Snapseed and Pixart. You can download them for free. It will take just five minutes of your time to make a great photo. So let's check it out how I do it. <laughs> After you have downloaded Snapseed and Pixart on your mobile phone, uh, you will go to the gallery and choose the photo you would like to edit. Now we're gonna use some photo from outside. We're gonna open it in Snapseed. First thing we're gonna do is click Tool and Add Detail. And sharpening a little bit. So, okay, this is the first step. Then you click tools, tune image, and you're gonna adjust some settings. Uh, let's see, shadows. So we don't want to be black since it's outside and we want some detail to be seen. So we will increase the shadows. We go to plus 44. Warmth, we're gonna do not touch that now. Uh, highlight. You can increase it a little bit ambience it's also showing more detail but we don't want to exaggerate it so we're gonna keep it here on 27 35 okay saturation okay now the color are really strong so we're gonna lower it a little bit so it's more natural contrast we don't need to touch it too much okay so we click ok then we're gonna add more details so we're gonna increase the details here don't do it too much because your photo uh, will become grainy so this is okay and now we're gonna use tools crop and we're gonna remove this empty space that we have okay this look good and if you want you can click vintage and add some vignette around your photo you can adjust here the brightness the saturation the style strength and the strength of it so we're gonna lower it we don't want to be too much dark okay i think this is good so in two three minutes you have this photo from this photo so you can see the difference it's really big and the photo look much better and it's ready to be posted on your Instagram so now we're gonna edit this photo of my gear in Snapseed and make it much better for Instagram so we have the photo here uh, below we have some presets from Snapseed but I don't uh, use them too much because they don't fit to every photo so the best way is to make your own first of all we're gonna click tools then tune image and we're gonna change some settings here uh, we're gonna lower the shadow not too much okay warm we don't need to touch that we can increase the highlights a little bit the ambience also we're gonna increase it so you see how the gear looks much better saturation we don't need to use it because our colors are great for example if your color is like this then you will use saturation to put it in some normal look the contrast you can play a little bit the contrast also depending on what you need brightness okay when you find your best settings you click ok then we're gonna use tools and then go to brush choose exposure and then put it to minus one if you your background it's white then you will go to one zero when the background it's dark you go to minus one zero so now you want to paint slowly 
around your gear and you can zoom so you do that much better and you don't make mistake Okay, now we are almost done here. So this is the first step. I think this is good. So now you press OK and then you go to tools and add some details. So you increase the details, not too much and you will see the line. So when you put the detail the sharpening in the mood you want you're gonna choose again brush and uh, click exposure and correct after you do this few time make this edit in under five minutes so this is it uh, this is our photo how it looked before and now look much better it's great for your Instagram. Uh, you can add your text, for example, your Instagram name. Okay, we're gonna lower it down. We're gonna make it a little bit transparent so it's not too bright. We don't wanna focus on that. We will make it like this. And that's it. You have a really nice edit of your photo and it's ready to be placed on Instagram. Now if you want to add uh, the logo of your sponsor or maybe your own logo on the photo, in that case I use a PixArt app since it's much better to do that than Snapseed. You also have many other options and settings uh, and effects that you can use so I recommend to have both of the app on your phone we're gonna add a logo we're gonna choose add photo then we're gonna choose the logo we want to add weapon 762 since we have their vest there uh, we're gonna use Spetsna arms okay we're gonna use uh, this two different type of logo since as you can see one it's transparent so you almost don't need anything to do you just resize it and post it wherever you want and you're ready to go but in case you have a logo like this one from Spetsna Arms uh, you can see uh, it's a black square so if we put it here it doesn't look so good so we're gonna blend it and fit it properly in the photo. You're gonna choose down below the option blend. And then you will have many settings like normal, screen, multiply, dark. Uh, you're gonna choose the one that will fit uh, the best on your photo. So we're gonna try with screen, okay. So this already look pretty good. We're gonna try to lower the opacity a little bit, okay. So I think now looks good. Then you need to place it whenever you want and you're ready to go. Of course, I don't put too many logo on the photo and I don't use that all the time only in some cases because i don't like a watermark i don't like uh, too much text on the photo and logos but if you want and you want to have it you can do it uh, this way you then you just click ok you click forward you go to save save and your photo is saved uh, in your gallery 
I hope you like my video, please don't forget to click the subscribe button and to hit the bell so you get a notification when I release a new video. Uh, thank you so much for watching and thank you so much for all the support. Stay safe and see you next time. Bye.